And we're going to get more uh, political coverage in just a minute. But first, we want to get you straight to this breaking news. Tonight in the Ohio River, Chopper 9, the only local helicopter getting you breaking news first, is overhead as search and rescue crews look for a car that crashed off the Combs Hale Bridge. Not on your sides, Ashley Zilka is live with new eyewitness accounts as the search for the car in the river continues now. Ashley? Well, police have allowed night on your side access onto this bridge. Take a look over here. You can still see there is a massive scene behind me. At least a dozens of police cars are on the bridge right now, and the sheriff's department has a helicopter searching for that missing car. I was just told this bridge will be closed for at least several more hours. As we know, a car has plunged into the Ohio River. Rescue crews are in the water trying to locate that vehicle. Now, no word on how many people were inside. Please tell me three additional vehicles were involved in the crash on this bridge. It's unclear of any injuries, but I did see several ambulances come by within the last hour. As far as traffic goes, police have done a really good job at allowing cars to make a U-turn one by one. I spoke to one truck driver earlier who was at the front of the traffic jam. It's been a mess, but I've been here an hour and 33 minutes. So I'm going to try and turn around and go back the other way. Going to try to turn around. Uh, so, how big of an inconvenience were you on the job, or what you have? Yeah, to I'm going to chill out these transformers. Mm -hmm. So, it's, uh, and I'm on e-log, so it's a mess. <laughs> now, if you take a look over here, there are still several cars and trucks that have decided to wait it out. They said there was no other way for them to get home. Interstate 275 is closed between 471 and Kellogg Avenue. Motorists are still advised to use an alternate route because, like I said, this bridge will still be closed for several more hours. But again, a car has plunged into the Ohio River, and we just learned that three other vehicles were also in this accident on the bridge. Reporting live tonight, Ashley Zilka, 9 on your side.